Hi, this is Anand Sureka. I work as a senior sales engineer at Guardian Analytics, and we're going to spend the next few minutes uh, looking at the Guardian Analytics ACH ODFI solution for fraud prevention. Now, we begin on the dashboard page here. Uh, it provides a whole lot of summary information and trending data on all ACH batches uh, at the bank. Uh, but for our demonstration, we're going to focus on the alerts tab. That's where a fraud analyst would typically begin his day. Now, before we start, I'd like to point out that all the data that you're going to look at is real customer data, and we, are, we have obfuscated some of the uh, important information like account numbers so that we can show you how the solution works in the real world. Now, of the hundreds of batches on this particular day, as a fraud analyst, I only need to focus on the reds or the high-risk transactions, which have now been bubbled up to the top uh, for, for, for today. I'm going to look at the first batch here, uh, the alert uh, with the risk score of 1.4. And uh, once I click on that, it leads me to what we call as our timeline page. Now, this is an originator-specific page. Uh, let me orient you here to the red indicator, uh, batch 286. Each column here is uh, a batch, uh, and the top row uh, is the final score associated with that batch. On the left-hand side, you see all uh, batch-level attributes. Uh, the solid green bars indicate uh, known established behavior, while the reds and the yellows uh, indicate uh, any anomalies that we see. Now, with that, uh, the easiest way to analyze this information is to simply read out the risk factors. Now, on this particular batch, you see a whole lot of new recipient uh, that have been added here, which uh, highlight the uh, risk uh, associated with this batch. The next one, you see the batch SEC code uh, of PPD uh, on, uh, on this uh, particular uh, instance. Uh, all the other ones with green are CCD uh, entries, while this batch uh, has a PPD, it's a PPD file, and hence uh, the associated risk. The next one talks about the unusual batch credit count. Uh, other, tra uh, other batches have always been a single transaction, while this one here has seven credit counts, again, increasing the risk on this uh, particular batch. The last one is the batch new recipient percent. It indicates that all recipients on this file uh, are new and never been seen uh, by this originator. You also get access to uh, individual batch entries here. Uh, you can uh, take a look at the, the individual accounts and routing information and the uh, details of the transaction. Now, with all of that information, we understand why there's a high risk associated with this particular batch here. And sure enough, the financial institution did confirm that this was a fraudulent batch, which was not submitted uh, by the originator. Now, in addition to the alerts management capability, you also get reports and uh, uh, case man uh, management capability uh, on the application to help you manage the ACH ODFI fraud uh, at the bank. Thank you.